Hello friends and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Dr. Mohsen Raj. I've done my MD from Ames New Delhi and now I'm pursuing a DM cardiology course at Ames New Delhi. And in this video, I will share a key strategy that actually helped me or at least contributed to my success. I had three consecutive All India Rank 1s and the DM entrance exams conducted by the, uh, you know, the NEED Super Specialty, AIMS and PGH and DPET. So let's get started. Now, let me ask you a question. What is the first thing you do in the morning when you wake up? And what is the last thing you do before you go to sleep? You can comment below and type your answers, but I guess many of you would would answer like some form of social media. Maybe you use Facebook, WhatsApp, Instagram or YouTube or some other form. But that's how our days are sandwiched. They start with social media, they end with social media and in between our days are filled with blocks of 10, 15 minutes at the, you know, least 10, 15 minutes of multiple blocks. And if you calculate at the end of your day, you'll be spending maybe a couple of hours at the least per day on social media. Now, let me ask you another question. How many of you can focus constantly for two consecutive hours? Can you, you can type your comments below, you can type your answers below, yes or no. Well, if your answer is no, let me tell you, how do you assume yourself to think and focus constantly for the two hours of your examination, actual entrance exam, whichever you are preparing for? I asked the same two questions to myself in July 2020 when I had started preparing for the DM entrance. And my answers were, yes, my days start with social media or end with social media. And yes, uh, I somehow had lost the ability to constantly think or focus for two consecutive hours. So then I did this one thing that actually changed all this. I deleted all forms of social media apps. I was having Facebook and WhatsApp on my mobile phone. I deleted those two apps. The only thing that was left on my phone was actually a Gmail app. So that facilitated an easy preparation. So I was no longer informed about someone who had a breakfast and put it as a post on the Facebook, someone who was worried or, or even some noxious political news or whatever, you know, no, irrelevant information from, from social media. See, there is nothing productive that you can get from social media, especially when you have a limited time for your exam. So I deleted everything and focused on the task at hand. See, it's not just about, you know, just a couple of hours of spending time on social media, but it's about the drain that your mental energy has. See, this is a negative influence on your mind. It drains your focus. It drains your mental energy. So when you go away from these distractions and you focus on the task at hand, you may study for just a few hours, but then you become more productive. You know, at the end of five hours of constant focus, you will have revised and read a lot of information. I encourage you to try such a thing for let's say two days stop checking social media delete the social media apps read for two days maybe four hours a day maybe six hours a day but with full focus and see how much you get done at the end of those two days so what happened with the strategy in july and august i prepared with full focus september i gave the exam of need super specialty and i was all india rank one I didn't even think of participating in the counseling. I focused again even more. Two more months, November, I got the All India rank in AIMS as well as in PGI Chandigarh. All because of the pure focus that deleting these social media apps helped me to build. See, our IQs are roughly the same. The resources that every student has are the same. Then what makes the difference? Why do people qualify INICT in the top 10 ranks or top 20 ranks and take the top branch in these best institutes? What is different is their passion, is their grit, is their focus. And it is something that is not by their birth. It is something that they build with practice. 
So uh, someone who is interested in bodybuilding, he will practice every day and practice and build his muscles. So if you want to focus, you practice it every day and you will develop that focus. And after all, the exam preparation lasts for just a few months, maybe a year maximum, you know, in your internship, you may have to prepare for a full year. And after the end of this preparation, once you get to your dream college, you get to your dream branch, you are done with the exam, of course, you can join back your normal routine life, you can be more social, maybe, you know, you have more social media apps than what you had originally. Maybe you start a YouTube channel the way I did, you know, now I'm more social interacting with many of you people. And I hope you like the content that I produce. Do like and do share and do subscribe to the channel. Thank you.